We got another cop busted for being a predator and a, of a minor. Here we go. Kansas City cop busted for being a serial predator of a minor. Yep, here we go. You ready for this? Let's go. Kansas City cop, damn shame, busted for being a serial predator. Yep. Let's put this picture up. Let's, let's do it full time. Disgusting Basuda! Basuda! Police officer Brock England. Brock England. You heard, ladies and gentlemen. Multiple children in two states. Two states. Him of sexual abuse, including a girl who said he forced himself on her at the age of eight. Wow! According to Oklahoma. England has been charged with sexual abuse of a child under 12. England has that reminds me of that other chief cop forced himself on a young child. In the Wichita uh, Police Academy, this was 2014. The investigation began October 2022 based on accusations from minors. Follow that date. October 2022, a Kansas Department for Children and Family Social Workers and a county detective interviewed a 13-year-old girl who said she had been raped by England in July 2018. When she was eight. This happened when she was eight, according to her. The girl told investigators the rape happened at England's mother's house in Bison, Oklahoma. England told the girl not to tell anyone or he would hurt her sibling. He then performed a the course, sexual act, the affidavit said. The girl told... A Typical fucking cop. Fucking pig says, yeah, deflecting them, their power, the, uh, the badge and law says, you know, telling them, oh, don't tell nobody I'm going to come haunt you. I'm going to hurt your family. Fucking pig. Sibling a year before the investigation started that Officer England had raped her, the sibling told authority. Another girl was interviewed October 2022. Mm. The second girl said during an interview that she was at England's apartment eight or nine years ago in Wichita. Wow. The girl was sitting on England's lap what? while playing a game on his phone. He threatened to take away the game if she didn't let Ew, nasty motherfucker is I got it. Nasty. Sick Fucking gross. Girl told an adult. Fucking gross. By the incident when she was 12, the woman made sure that the girl had no further contact with England. It's unclear from the affidavit how old she was at the time England allegedly touched her. Second victim told investigators of two other girls. The third girl was interviewed by Kansas Department for Children and Family. Oh, third this girl. This was in Wichita. This keeps getting bigger the girl and better. On multiple occasions, Officer England would give her massages. That Whoa. led to him touching what? her oh. parts. The girl recalled the incidents happening when England was in the Wichita Police Department Academy. It's not clear if law enforcement officers were able to interview the fourth child. So there was a fourth child, but I can't get a hold of her. Police Department from June 2014 until August 2019. Then he left to work for the uh, Enid Police Department. He returned to the Wichita Police Department. Turn? What the December fuck? He had been on paid administrative leave from Wichita Police Department since October when the investigation began. He was also placed on unpaid leave Tuesday morning, a police spokesperson said. You have a predator who, based on accusation, yeah. has likely been a predator his entire time as a law enforcement. And you let the scumbag leave and be a law enforcement to another agency. Unexcusable. Unexcusable. Really is. I'm an officer. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, yeah. You mean to tell me that this man worked among all of these detectives, these trained individuals? Yep. And nobody had an inkling, even after investigations and accusations started to... Especially when there are four way. victims? Nobody said, wait a minute. There needs to be another investigation. This is... Too much. Way what too much. To the individuals who are willing to simply cross all the T's.
down all of the eyes, eyes and make exactly. sure the communities are safe. Put them on paid administrative leave pending the results of an investigation. As soon as you got a whiff that this mm-hmm. individual was possibly yeah. killed, it's not only wrong, it's deadly to keep people like this employed. Yeah. All right. Sharon, thoughts here. I'm shaking my head because it's so pathetic. There's so much detail, Dr. Ritchie, that makes me want to detonate already, Officer England. But there's so much pathetic, disgusting, mind-boggling detail. Dude, you know what it makes me want to do? It, ma- it makes me want to go to Walmart, purchase a Luis uh, metal baseball bat, or a wood baseball bat, Luis Slugger baseball bat, a Luis Slugger baseball bat. Find this guy, find this disgusting fucking creep, and take a swing, full head on, and hope I damage his fucking head, and break his jaw, and skull. That's how I'm pissed off. That's how disgusting this motherfucker is. Here. That I think it's fair. I like to take to his, basically, I want to use his head as job. fucking T-ball practice. Yeah. Yeah. Children. It could not have been done here, Okay. You mentioned these adults who didn't do enough, and I think that's clear. Listen to kids. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Listen to kids. Don't Listen. ignore. That's right. And keep that line of communication exactly. open. Exactly. Right? Children may not always be listening, but they are always learning. And even if they don't talk to you about anything or, or about everything, all right, they go through phases. Yeah, and here's one more thing for you out here. You know, if kids have a problem and they're expressing their feelings and problems like that, listen to them. Don't brush them and ignore them. If they're telling you something is wrong and expressing their important feelings up, listen. Because maybe there is something deeper. Uh, maybe the fact that a fucking creep, a groomer, a pedophile groomed them and the trust is broken and they, they're reaching out for you. Listen, learn, live. It was my hair much up. Peace out.